What is a cervical stitch? A cervical stitch is an operation where a stitch is placed around the cervix, neck of the womb. It is usually done between 12 and 24 weeks of pregnancy although occasionally it may be done at later stages in pregnancy. A cervical stitch is more commonly put in vaginally, transvaginal, and less commonly tummy, transabdominal. Infants born early, before 37 weeks of pregnancy, present an increased risk of short, and long-term health problems which we shall discuss later. Although, here are numerous potential causes for early delivery. One possible cause is that the neck of your womb becomes shorter and opens too early. A stitch to your womb, S neck may help to prevent this. However, you should be referred to a specialist early in your pregnancy if you have had a miscarriage after 16 weeks of pregnancy you have had a previous birth before 34 weeks of pregnancy your waters broke before 37 weeks in a previous pregnancy you have had certain types of treatment to your cervix, for example, cone biopsy for treatment of an abnormal smear, your healthcare team may arrange for you to have transvaginal ultrasound scans to measure your cervix. If it is found to be short, less than 25 long, you may be offered a cervical stitch a hormonal treatment with progesterone pessaries a combination of the two treatments above close monitoring by your healthcare team. Stitch neck of womb through tummy also known as abdominal circlage. This involves an operation to put a stitch around patient, S cervix, through her tummy, and is also called a transabdominal circlage. Transabdominal circlage is an uncommon procedure but may be recommended if a vaginal cervical stitch has not worked in the past or if it is not possible to insert a vaginal stitch. It is done either before you become pregnant or in early pregnancy. It may be done through a cut on your abdomen or via keyhole surgery. T his sort of stitch is not removed and your baby would need to be born by cesarean section. Rescue stitch Occasionally, patient may be offered a stitch as an emergency procedure after her cervix has already opened up, to help prevent having a late miscarriage or preterm birth. This is called a rescue stitch and your healthcare team will discuss the risks and benefits of this with you. This type of stitch has higher risks and doesn't always work. Taking out the stitch Your stitch will be taken out at the hospital. This will normally happen at around 36 to 37 weeks of pregnancy, unless you go into labor before then. You will not normally need anesthetic for removal of the stitch. A speculum is inserted into your vagina and the stitch is cut and removed. It usually takes just a few minutes and you may experience some discomfort. Occasionally, you will be advised by your healthcare professional that you will need an anesthetic for removal of the stitch. You may notice some blood staining or vaginal spotting afterwards. This should settle within 24 hours but you may have a brown discharge for longer. If you have any concerns, you should tell your healthcare professional. If you go into labor with the cervical stitch still in place, you should contact your maternity unit straight away. It is important to have the stitch removed to prevent damage to your cervix. If your waters break early but you are not in labor, the stitch will usually be removed because of the increased risk of infection. The timing of this will be decided by the healthcare team looking after you. Things to look for Patient should contact her healthcare team if she experiences any of the following. Contractions or cramping abdominal pain. Continued or heavy vaginal bleeding. 
your water's breaking. Smelly or green vaginal discharge, 